hello guys it is nice coding site in this lesson I will show you and I will explain the structure of HTML uh, let's create a folder on our desktop folder rename it anything you want but I will name my own to be intro underscore html and then i will go right to my text editor i'm using subline text editor the last one we have downloaded open it we will open that folder which we created on our desktop Open folder. Here is the folder. Then you click it and you open it. Inside this folder, you right click new file. Create a file inside that folder. Uh, we, are, we are going to save this file. It is a good practice for you to save a file before you proceed. Save us, click it, give it a name. I will just say structure, structure dot HTML. Save it. There we go, we save our file. Then the next thing you will do is you have to bring the syntax of HTML, which is the structure. That I will show you right now. The beauty of subline text is bringing a suggestion and auto completing. That is, is bringing you a suggestion. You just have to click tab since it is on this syntax. Here we go. Uh, what you are seeing here is a syntax of a channel. Um, but let's give a space for us so that it will be clear. Um, so now, this thing that you're seeing here is Doctai HTML. This indicates that the document type is HTML5, which is the, the version being used today. That is the standard. Uh, the HTML here, uh, this element encloses everything inside of HTML document that includes tags, elements, style sheets, scripts, and multimedia, a lot more. This element encloses it. As you can see, it is open here, and it is closed at the last button here. So let's go to head. The head here, this element enclosing a, encloses a metadata. The meta, metadata means which a document which will not display on the main content of the web. Example of that, you have the script, the title of your page, the meta tags, and a lot more. As you can see here, it is close here. This one, the title here, it shows that if you put anything inside of here let's try some let's say my website it will display on the main let's save it save it save let's try to display it on the web okay now uh let's find our here is our folder 
let's try to open it on a chrome it could be any browser if you like but i love working with chrome as you can see here i have not displayed anything on the web uh, my page content but here is the title web my website that is the that is that is the meaning of the title to display your page title the body here um, this element encloses elements of your walking that is the content of your page it could be paragraph it could be heading it could be image multimedia lot more this body encloses everything is where you can type your code here you can type everything and it will be displayed on the uh, page and you save it you refresh the page here as you can see here, I just this is bunch of bunch of uh, words that they unorganized. So now let's try to put something meaningful. Uh, just say my my name is Simon Simon John. Let me complete it. Let's say I save it. <clears throat> refresh it you see it my name is Simon John here is the closing body here okay guys uh, this is a basic HTML structure that is HTML5 the standard one being used today um, thank you make sure you subscribe for this channel for more videos and make sure you follow the tutorial it is nice coding sites bye bye